everybody. Brad Nessler here, and with me as always, Kirk Herbstreit and Lee Corso. And it's going to be a cold afternoon for this game between the Arkansas Razorbacks and the Oregon State Beavers. I'm really looking forward to this one, as it should be a very exciting bowl game. And here come the Beavers. The Razorbacks are going to have to play a great football game if they expect to win this one, Kirk. Oregon State will win this football game because of their quarterback. And the thing I noticed about him is his ability to spread the ball out to a number of different receivers. I think he'll have a solid game, and they're going to win by two touchdowns. I've been quiet about this, but I think it's finally time for my pick. Oregon State will win this one, sweetheart. Now that looks good on you, Lee. Anyway, let's set it down to the field. We're ready to get this one underway. The teams are lined up for the opening kick. Kicks it deep. Number 20 falls for the fair catch. Strange decision there. Coach, help us. This quarterback is the leader of this team, but he's going to need some help from his offensive line today as they go up against a very good pass rush. You got that right, Brad. He's the focal point of this offense, and the defensive line knows it. They're going to be coming after him hard today. When you're as good as this kid is at playing quarterback, there's definitely a bullseye painted on your chest. We'll see how he handles the pressure. Oregon State comes out with an eye formation. Here's an option, right side. Lateral back. Spins up field. They'll bring him down. The offensive line got a really good push there, allowing the back to pick up nine on the play. Third down and three coming up. Ball on their own 27. They come out in a goal line set. Little shake and bank move. Duncan with a takedown. How about that call? Cool. This is Lee's favorite play. Good call. The quarterback did a good job of following the push line. It's first and ten. Ball on the 32. Number two with three wide receivers. They'll run the option. Breaks one. Brought down. Second and one. And this is the fifth play in the current drive. Little handoff. And he's taken down. Oh, coach, you picked up a few yards on that one. Brett, tough running by this kid. It's first and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. Number two is back in the gun. They'll throw on first down. He lets it go. Got an opening. He's knocked out of bounds. A gain of nine yards on the play. Second and one coming up here. And this is the seventh play of the current drive. And they'll run him again. He's got an opening. There's a missed tackle. And they make the stop. And that gives him 1,000 yards rushing on the season. It's always special when you reach that 1,000 yard mark. Yeah, coach, it's hard enough for these players to stay healthy for an entire season, let alone rush for 1,000 yards. The Beavers line up in an eye formation. Somebody jumped early down there. There was movement on the offensive line before the ball was snapped. That's one of the young offensive linemen who was too anxious to spring into his block. First down and 15 to go. Ball on the 40. Again, he'll get the call. He's hit and got away. And they hit him in the backfield. Excellent play by the defense that time as they swallowed him up before he got back to the line. It's more like they devoured him. Yeah, no shot at breaking clean. Second and long coming up here. Ball on the 41. Number two with three wide receivers. Back to pass. Looking, steps up, he's going right. Batted ball. The defender could only get a hand on it. A hand on it. If this kid wants to be a big-time playmaker, he better start getting two hands on it. Yeah, that ball should have been picked off there. The offense faces another third down as they line it up. The Beavers go with the I formation. 
They'll run the option. Wants to throw outside. Finds his receiver. And they convert the third down with a long pass play. You're right, Brad, and that was a long pass play. As a coach, you got to appreciate it when you first come and perform like these kids are doing right now. It's first and ten. Ball on the 16. The Beaver come out of the two tight end set. Here's the give. They'll wrestle him down to the backfield. That blitz couldn't have worked any better for the defense or any worse for the offense. Second, Second and 15. 15. Ball on the 21. Ball on the 21 yard line. They line up in the shotgun. Cut. High snap as he works from the gun. He rolls out to the right. No one opens, so he's going to run. Joseph brings him down. Oregon State will line up in a jumbo set here. Fullback on the inside here. Duncan with a takedown. Unbelievable. They can't get this offense off the field. They've been like a machine on this drive. During the five position, once again, they're moving the chain. The Beaver come to the line with their jumbo package. And they got him for a loss. He let that little corner bring it down. To be a productive runner at the college level, you have to make that guy miss a couple Oregon State lines up in a goal line set. They'll give it off here. Good idea giving it to the halfback near the end zone. Why would you give it to this guy? He told me before the game, if he gets the ball this time to 10, he's a five-star lock. He's going to score. the PAT. And now let's take a look at the drive summary brought to you by Pontiac. Number 43 looks ready to kick this one off. Four, takes it from the six. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll start this drive at the 24-yard line. Moore lines up in the shotgun. Moore drops to throw. He's looking across the middle, and down he goes. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make a play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result was the first down. The defensive back moving in closer. Drops back to pass. He steps up. He's going left. Picks it off. It's the safety who's in the right place at the right time. The quarterback has to know where the safety is when he makes this kind of throw. Right here, he's just trying to force something that wasn't there. They'll get the ball here at the 38-yard line. Number two is back in the gun. Inside give. And he's tackled a couple, maybe three yards on that run. Right, second down and seven to go. Ball, ball on their own 41. Two tight ends here. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. And he's stopped behind the line. Look at that. The blitz just threw off their blocking signs. And that's why this running back is looking for a mouthpiece right now. Third and ten. Ball on the 38-yard line. The Beaver go with the I formation. They'll run the option. Wants to throw outside. Couldn't haul it in. He put a little something extra on that throw, and the receiver mishandled it. He needed other mitts for that one because it was a hot tamale. And we come to the end of the first quarter. But the score, Florida State, seven, Arkansas, nothing. The Beavers are lining up to punt it away. Abrams gets it off. Abrams fields it for 22. And how many times do you go back there and throw another pick? As you know, a quarterback needs a short memory, so I really don't remember, Steve. You know better than that. <laughs> Steps up in the pocket. He's going right. It falls incomplete, and he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. Second and ten. Ball on their own ten. Moore lines up in the shotgun. Moore drops back to pass. Comes across the middle, and he's got it. Going the other way now. That last INT gives this defense two on the day. Not a good throw there, and the quarterback needs to make better decisions. And they'll look to capitalize on a good field position here. 
Oregon State comes out of the shotgun. He drops back, looking, rolls to the left. Deep pass down the left side. It's deflected. Guys, he tipped that one away from the receiver. Excellent hit the ball. He almost intercepted the ball. Really the next best though. And that's the touchdown. So it's second and ten. Ball in the 33. Number two is the impact player, and he's feeling it right now. The option left. Missed tackle. Spin move. He knows how to run. Tackle. Nice running on the option there. That was a spectacular option keeper there. And I'm going to tell you why. It looked like that play was going nowhere, but this quarterback made the right choice by holding on to the football. You're right. Good heads-up play there by the QB. In the red zone again. Let's see if it'll be another touchdown. Here's the option. They got four yards on that one. Second six coming up here. Ball on the 14-yard line. Number 20 is in the zone and looking to make something happen. And now he pitches it, and the offense will recover. Are you kidding me? They recovered the fumble. The man, oh man was that close call. Mm. <laughs> that's about as ugly as an option can look. Well, it certainly wasn't pretty, that's for sure. But like Brad said, they recovered the football. It's part of the pass now, so they just need to get about it and focus on their next play. Here's the option left. Touchdown, Oregon State. The quarterback ran it all the way in for a score. You can't forget about the quarterback out there. Right there, the defense didn't account for him, and that's why he was able to get into the end zone. And he tacks on the extra point. And with four minutes to go in the second quarter, our court, Oregon State, 14, Arkansas, nothing. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. We can have a return on this one. Abram has the five. And now we'll see the offense come out of the field for their next event. They'll go to work at the 26. The Razorbacks come out in the ace formation. And they make the stop. A nice six-yard gain by the tailback there. Second and four coming up here. Ball on the 32-yard line. Moore with three wide receivers. Juke move. Has some daylight. Sheds a tackler. At the 40. Inside the 30. To the 20. Goodbye. Touchdown. Razorback. the PAT. Here's the Pontiac Drive Summary, bringing you fuel for the soul. Clement is lined up to get this one off. Decent kick, looks to be returnable. Looks to me as though the offensive line is trying to run balls more. And that defensive line got to be ready because if they are, they'll be giving up another touchdown drive. They'll set up shot at the 20-yard line. The Beavers come out in a shotgun. Here's the option. He spins. And they push him out. He kept it himself and picked up a good looking for him. Another reason why I love the option. Just need to pick up the pitch. He gets up the field and keeps the ball himself. No question, coach. Great execution and a good decision there by the quarterback. The defense sets up with five defensive linemen. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. A defensive end came through to put him away. Nice job of utilizing his athletic ability to get in there and to make a sure catch. Second down and 12. Ball on their own 30. Number two is back in the gun. They'll run the option. He laterals the ball. He jukes. Fumbles the ball. And the offense picks it up. And he's stopped behind the line. They run the option and almost cost him. You can't fumble the football like that. Coach is calling the trust his players to take care of the football. They are very, very fortunate to get that one back. They sure are. That one had turnover written all over it. They line up in an eye. On the ground with a tailback. He broke his ankle. The 50. They'll bring him down. And they come up huge on that play. Oh, he sure did. He's a tough guy and always seems to have a little extra when he needs it. It's first and ten, and this is the fifth play of the current drive. They line up in the shotgun. The option left. Ball is loose. Fumble. And they fall on the loose ball. Coach, what went wrong there for the offense? Poor execution. They got to spend more time on the option in practice before they bring it into the game. They'll take over at the 37. Arkansas lines up in the shotgun set. It's a bad snap. He's gobbled up in the backfield. They just couldn't get any kind of push up front. And the O line does not work. They couldn't get any leverage and end up losing yards on a quarterback sneak. Uh, that's worth a yo. Back to pass. Short toss. And it's caught. Gets past the tackler. Knocked out of bounds. Gain of nine. Two minutes to go in the half. They line up in an eye. 
Moore steps back to pass. And now he's going to run. Broke away from one. He made a real nice play on that one. I'll tell you what, in today's game, you have to have the ability to the ball. Give the quarterback a lot of credit. He made a great play and really gave his team a boost. Moore with three wide receivers. They'll throw on first down. Watch to throw a screen. Complete. And they make the stop. Arkansas calls a timeout. And they got two remaining. Second three coming up. This is the fifth play of this drive. Moore off the fake. Incomplete. Great pressure on the quarterback forced that incomplete. They really pounded him on that spot. They sure did, but somehow he got rid of the football. So another third down upcoming for the offense. The Razorbacks come out with split backs. They'll run for the first on third and short. Robinson brings it down. Third down has been the charm on this drive. It's been all about execution. They come to play the right play at the right time. They've been able to do this here. It's first and ten. Ball on the 37. They line up in an eye. Moore goes with the play fake. He's going right. And they couldn't hook up on that one. And that pass falls incomplete because it was deflected. That's, right there, That's something the coaches always remind their players to do. Get a hand up in the face of the quarterback. Moore comes to the line with three wide. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. Throws it to the outside. And he shoved out of bounds. Way to look at him. Nice catch. Sure was. He's played some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. First and ten. Ball on the 24-yard line. Moore with three wide receivers. Another run. A little juke. And now he's got room to run. Brought down. Arkansas takes a timeout. Moore is in the zone and looking to make a play. Moore back to throw with the throw. And it's caught. Touchdown, Arkansas. He stepped up and threw a touchdown pass to his wideout. Good job with protection. And the quarterback's finally made. And he tacks on the extra point. This drive summary brought to you by Pontiac. Arkansas to kick this one off. Kicks it deep. Number 89 calls for the fair catch. Not sure the defense will be trying to strip the ball once again. If these kids will start heading out to the football, they won't see it at all. They might start putting in some of those They'll defensive the players that really want to play bad. Number two is back in the gun. Cut. They'll throw on first down. Rolling out to the left side. He throws it. It's tipped. That's just good defense right there, Coach. It was perfect, but you know what? It's all the action. Anytime you're out there on defense and it passes within arms like away, you knock it down. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 20. They come out with three wide receivers. Over the middle. Found his man. The 50 at the 40. Down the sideline. To the 20. Goodbye. Do they have that defense guessing now or what? I mean, did you see how well the quarterback hit the ball? Yeah, some quarterbacks are just so good at selling the play action. It's truly an overlooked skill. You take my friend Kirk here, for example. He wasn't known for his speed, but boy, he can do a good play fake. Are you calling me slow? This is coming from a guy whose nickname is based on his foot speed. Isn't that right, Scooter? Yeah, left out sunshine. It's sunshine, Scooter, sweetheart. And he hits the PAT. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. Number 43, looks ready to kick this one off. He puts it deep downfield. Number 84, feels it in the end zone. Thanks to some nice passing on the last drive. The offense was able to take it down the field for six. A great play calling to help make that an easy drive. The question is, can they do it again? They'll throw on first down. Throws this one out to the right. Incomplete pass. Second and ten. Ball on the 20. The defense comes up tight on the coverage. He drops back. Steps up. He tosses it short. The ball is tipped. You gotta be careful throwing in the coverage like that. Well, coach, I don't think it was a poor decision. It's just a great reaction by the man in coverage. It's third down and ten. Ball on the 20-yard line. They come out in a nickel. Inside give. And he's taken down. Oregon State calls a timeout. They line up and put this one away. Puts the ball away. Number 89 fields it at the 37. Great passing was the key for the offense last time they had the ball. They were able to pick apart the defense and get down the field for a touchdown. So if I'm the coach, I'm my defensive lineman. You get more pressure on that quarterback, please. Oregon State comes out in the shotgun. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. Let's it go. He's got it on the run. Move those sticks. That's a first down. And a great catch, too. Did you see how he looked that one in? Well, there's no doubt about it. He can catch the football. Right, look at our old spot.
sacrifice red zone numbers. Red zone, when performance matters the most. The beater, come on the shotgun. They'll run the option. Can't wrap him up, and he's in there. Touchdown. And the quarterback has two rushing touchdowns so far today. Quarterbacks usually get the job done through the air, but this guy's taking care of things on the ground. Tax on the extra point. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive over it. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Gets it off. Abram fields it at the seven. The offense gets ready to start a new drive. Going three and out. They'll start this drive at the 25. Arkansas lines up in a pro set. Him down in the backfield. They might want to run away from that guy next time. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on the 24 yard line. Nickel defense. And we've reached halftime here. The score at the break. Oregon State got the ball to start the game, so they'll be kicking off to start the second half. Kicks it off. Number 84 takes it at the four. And now we see the offense come out of the field for their next possession. They'll get the ball here at the 21. Now's not the time for a blown coverage. This quarterback is in the zone. They'll give it off here. And down he goes. And that run will give him 100 for the game. The old head coach has to be happy with the running game today. It's second down and eight to go. Ball in the 23. Three wide outs here. Back to pass. He steps up. Throws this one out to the right. Got it. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. They'll run the option. Here he goes. Tackle. Second and less than a yard. Ball on their own 44. The Razorbacks line up with three wide. Inside handoff. He jukes it. And he's tackled. And he carried that one for a few yards. You know, when you have a guy that can grab five yards or so consistently, it sure takes some of the pressure off the passing game. The Razorbacks line up in an eye formation. Moore with the give. He can scoop inside the 30, to the 20, to the 10, and he's all the way in for the touchdown. Second touchdown there. Really and you could tell he really wanted to get in on that one. Yeah, he showed a lot of determination and heart on that run. That's a nice touchdown. And he hits the PAT. Over four minutes remaining here in the third quarter. And the score, Oregon State 28, Arkansas 21. Clement ready to kick. He kicks it. Number 89. Fields it at the two. At the 30. And now we'll see the offense come out of the field for their next position. They'll go to work at the 35. From the gun. Here's an option. Right side. He breaks free. Down the sideline. And down he goes. Oh, that was one beauty of an option by that quarterback. No question. There was no hesitation whatsoever. Once he saw that hole, he turned it up the field and left everybody in the dust. Well, almost everybody. First and ten. Ball on the 35-yard line. The Beaver. Come out in the shotgun. They'll run the option. He spins around. Now he pitches it. Fumble. Loose ball. Scooped up the loose ball. George with a takedown. They tried the option there, and now they're on their way to the sideline. You're not going to stay on the field during all this time like that. I don't care if you're running the option or not. There's just no excuse. I'll tell you what. Write this down. The team with the most takeaways at the end of the year will have a winning record, and the teams with the most giveaways will have a losing record. It's been that way as long as I've been around this game. No one open, so he's going to run. Brought down. Hit second down and one to go. Ball right around midfield. Ace backfield. Moore with the give. Frazier brings it down, and the counter is good enough for the first. Yeah, the offensive line did a good job of setting that play on that one. And the halfback was aware of that first down line and got the conversion. Going with the shotgun here. Moore to the air on first down. Across the middle, and he's taken down. They got about 10 yards on that play. Second and less than a yard. Ball on the 39. The Razorbacks come out in the ace formation. On the ground with the tailback. And he's still on his feet. 
Frank tackles him for a loss on the play. They didn't let him get anything going on that play. No, they didn't. Heck, they didn't even let him get back to last year. The defensive back's moving closer. They'll run for the first on third and short. Daniel, what a takedown. Well, Kirky managed to get enough there to move the chains. Yep, that's a great effort there by the running back to be able to get the ball upfield and pick up another valuable first down. It's first and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. Arkansas comes out with an eye formation. Handoff, makes a move. He's into the open field. And they make the stop. He's not your ordinary fullback. This guy can move. You bet he can. I like it. He's a heck of a football player. They need to get him some more carries. They shift on their defensive front. Play. Hunt brings him down. Three yard gain by the running back. Second seven. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Moore with three wide receivers. It's a direct snap. Robinson tackles it for a loss on the play. Nice tackle to bring him down before he got back to the line of scrimmage. Solid effort there to break up that play. So another third down upcoming for the offense. This defense better be careful. The quarterback is in the zone and really feeling it out there. Moore drops back to pass. Throws down the middle. Got him on the run. They'll bring him down. That's how you convert third down, sweetheart. That was a good looking play when it comes. Oh, yeah, this offensive point has to see something the defense he really liked. The offense got six the last time they were inside the 20. Let's see what they do here. And they'll run him again. McWilliam with a takedown. One yard on the play. Let's see if they can punch this one in. He's rolling left. Throws this one out to the right. Picked off in the end zone. He's going to come out. It looks like he was hurt on that last play. Yeah, I don't think it's too serious, though, guys. He's a tough athlete. I think we'll see him back in this game. They'll set up shot at the 20-yard line. The Beavers come out in a two-tight end set. On the ground with a tailback. Brought down. That's a nice six-yard game. The second down and four to go. Ball on the 26-yard line. Trips right. Here's the pitch, left side. Sheds that one. And he stopped behind the line. A loss on that one as he couldn't get past those big linemen. You got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed it. Third and six. Ball on the 24-yard line. Going with the shotgun here. He's into the open field. With the spin. He's all the way down to the 48-yard line. the end of the third quarter. Our score in this one, Oregon State 28, Arkansas 21. It's first and 10, ball on the 48-yard line. High formation here, inside give. Got some open field. To the 20, to the 10. Touchdown, Oregon State. There's number two on the day. The coach loves to give the football to this running back. You know why? Because he knows how to find the end zone. And he taps on the extra point. Here's the Pontiac drive somewhere. Bring you fuel for the soul. Number 23 looks ready to kick this one off. He was at deep downfield. Number 84 fields it in the end zone. He drives to shoot. The defense won the last battle. They were able to take the ball off. They'll win this match. They'll start this drive at the 19-yard line. The D-line shifts over. Moore makes a handoff. He passes it. Complete. Daniel brings him down for a loss. Couldn't get anything out of that. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 19. 19 yard line. Hut. 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 Here's the give. Wong brings him down. Four yard gain by the back. It's third down and six to go. Ball on the 23. Arkansas comes to the line with three wide. Hut. 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 
Drops back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Looks. Throws this one out to the left. Got it to his receiver. That's just airing it out on third down. That was more than enough to pick up the first down. Next time, this defense will be playing on their heels. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. Moore is back in the gun. They'll throw on first down. He unloads it. And he's going to lose yards on this one. There's that two yards by the line. It's second down and 12 to go. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. Moore lines up in the shotgun. Little shake and bake move. And down he goes. First and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. The defensive back's moving in closer. Moore to the air on first down. He's going right. Webb with a takedown. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is the first down. Moore drops the throw. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. It's second down now, 13 to go. Ball on the 25-yard line. Moore comes to the line with three wide. He drops it back. And now he's going to run. Tackle. He scrambled and maybe picked up a yard there. The offense faces another third down as they line it up. They line up in the shotgun. Moore set to go to the air. And it's caught. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Drop back four yards on that one. Arkansas lines up with three receivers. Back to pass. Steps up. Across the middle. Still perfect on the drive. And they're going to have to give the ball back after going for it on fourth and long. Not much you can do there. you got to go for it and give yourself a chance. They'll get the ball here at the 14. They line up with trips to the right. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. Lost it about two. And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. Here he goes. He's hit and got away. Peters brings him down. Arkansas takes a timeout. First and ten. Ball to 29. He gets another carry. They'll drop him for a loss. Arkansas calls a timeout. All right, second and 12 coming up here. Ball on their own 27. The Beaver come out showing three wide. He's rolling right, looking, and he's going to come up with a sack. The quarterback had nowhere to go, and he's brought down for the sack. They've got to do a better job of putting with their pass protection. If they don't start picking up everybody, then this quarterback will be pretty sore in the morning. That's for sure. Third down and a couple miles here. Ball in the 21. They'll work from the shotgun. The option left. Bounces off the would-be tackler. Yuku. And he's taken down. Arkansas takes a timeout. Oregon State lining up the punt. Abrams gets it off. Abrams fields it for 39. Burke lays it on him. The offense saw their last drive end on fourth down. Do we see a similar result this time? They'll go to work at the 42-yard line. When this quarterback's in the zone, as he is now, he can do a lot of damage to the defense. Over the middle. Wong, what a take now. Good job on the pass there. Yeah, let me tell you something. These passes are exactly what they need to put pressure on that defense. Ace backfield. He juiced. Frank brings him down. And that was a nice run. Kirk, that was a great job by that big offensive line. Yeah, it really was, Brad. And also, nice lead by the ball carrier to find that running back. When you break one like that, you got to give a lot of credit to the offensive line. Looks like offsides. Here's the official call. First down and five to go. Ball on the 34-yard line. From the gun. Drops back to pass. He's going right. Off his hands and incomplete. Dropped by the wideout. Second down and five. Ball on the 34. The Razorbacks set up in the gun. Moore, back to pass. He steps up. Here he goes. He's going to take off. And they make the stop. He had a whole lot of room to run on that one. When the pressure's coming from the inside and the quarterback can escape the pocket, it usually means he's going to have some room to run. 
He got back to the line of scrimmage, but not much more. The Razorbacks come out in the ace formation. Again, he'll get the call. He tries to spin, breaks one, big opening, touchdown, Arkansas. That is rushing touchdown number three. And he hits the PAT. Fine post at Pontiac, bringing us the summary of how that drive took place. Arkansas is lining up for the onside kick here. With the onside kick. Spins up the field. The offense comes back down the field, hoping to build off their last drive. It's all about execution. We saw them move the football, but they were unable to move it when it mattered most. But Lee, I think you have to give credit to this defense. They tightened up when they had to, and they looked to move the and he'll just kneel it here. And that's the end of the game. Coach, what's your final thought on the game? This is why I'm up here with you guys. Coaching a game like this might give you a heart attack. Oregon State really got all they asked for and more in this contest. Great job by both teams. We look forward to calling more games of NCAA Football 2006. But until then, our final score in this one, Oregon State 35, Arkansas 28.